finally, my last question here for today is question 11. It says, which electron in sulfur is most shielded from, uh, from nuclear charge? And then I have all of those questions here. So let me write this down here. It says, which electron in sulfur is most shielded from nuclear charge? And A says here, it says an electron, it's an electron in 1s orbital. B here says an electron in 2p orbital. C is electron in 3p. And then D is none of the above. Okay, so when we look at when we look at here when we look at our our uh, electron figure configuration, let's draw this out, right? So we have sulfur here is going to be one s two, two s two, two p six, three s two, and finally three p four, right? So let's draw out the electron configuration here. So sulfur is one s two, and then two s two, two p six, three s two and three, three, P, four, right? Uh, so I have these guys here, and it says which one is the, which electron in sulfur is the most shielded from electro, from nuclear charge, right? So if you think about the shielding effect, if you were to draw out this, uh, if I were to draw out the energy level diagram, I'll draw this out in red here. I'm gonna write basically one S2 is here, then I have two S2 is going to be here, two P6 will be, like so, uh, this would be 3s2 is here, and then 3p and a 4. Right? So I have 1, 2, 3, and 4 here. So this here is going to be my electron configuration or an energy level diagram for these guys here. If I want to talk about the shielding effect from nuclear charge here, you can think of the uh, nucle nucleus is somewhere down here, right? The nucleus of the of the sulfur atom is here, and then you can think of these guys as uh, uh, in in terms of increasing energy level. One s two would be the lowest in, uh, uh, in terms of energy level, and then you have two s two, two p six, three s two, and then three p four. Right. So it's asking us which electron sulfur is most shielded from nuclear uh, uh, the electron from nuclear charge. It's going to be my further my electrons that are furthest away. Right. So in this case, it would be my three p four electrons here. They're most shielded because they experience they experience the most shielding effect. Right. The electrons here are very very far away very very far away from my nucleus right in terms of distance so it's going to experience the most um it's most shielded from nuclear charge here so the the uh the interactions between the nucleus and the 3p4 uh, electrons here are very very minimal because of these electrons here they're uh, already um, bonded more tightly towards uh, the nucleus on um, the you can think of these as our valence electrons here experience the most uh, uh will be the most uh, shielded electrons because they are the outer parts of the uh, of the atom here so this solution is correct here it says uh the correct option is c because it's three p orbitals so this solution here is correct so these three p, three p orbitals are good and it's saying that the outer electrons are repelled by the inner electrons is thus shielded by inner electrons right remember that these guys here are also these are all negative charges right this is negative these guys are all negative so they don't these guys are going to repel each other, whereas the nucleus here is positive, right? So these guys are going to repel each other, therefore it's shielded by most electrons, electrons here. So this solution is correct. Great analysis for this problem here.